Hi Libra, it's Elle here to do your September 2018 general read. Now it's a general read so it will not resonate with each and every Libra out there. But if it does resonate with you, please like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel. It's much appreciated. Make sure you're commenting below because you could be entered to win a free reading with me for September. Alright, um, I hope that everyone is, ha is having a really good August. Um, almost wrapping up for us. Um... What else is going on? What am I feeling energetically for Libra? Okay. Uh, some of you are really busy. Some of you have your own businesses and you're really busy. Uh, some of you are like a psychologist, counselor, tarot card reader. Anyway, you work with people with who have issues that need res you know, to be resolved. Uh, some of you do social work also. Um, some of you have someone coming back from the past. Maybe a Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, the Tower just popped out. The Two of Swords, Sun and Libra. Got to make a decision, not making one. Waiting for mental clarity. Also trying to protect your heart. Your heart and your mind are not aligned, so it's, it's confusion there. Um... It looks like, um, yeah, you got somebody coming back or they came back. They caused a lot of heartbreak and, and sorrow issues in the past. Not to say that there isn't love between the two of them. It's just that um, it's, um, it's a dynamic. Let's say that. It's a, it's a uh, interesting dynamic. Um... Some of you dealing with another air sign. There's just an air, in air. Yeah. You know, there's a, a sense of boredom with this connection. Could be uh, Aquarius. I'm not feel, really feeling Gemini. It could be an Aquarius. There's a sense of boredom. Um. Some of you suffer some financial loss. Some of you are angry. Let's see. Some of you just made some really big ticket purchases. Yeah, maybe even a change of um, job here, change of career. It happened pretty quickly. Prince of Swords. Prince of Wands, uh, Ace of Swords, Prince of Pentacles, nice. Princess of Cups, the Devil. Yeah, this is that connection I was feeling. Um, maybe a water sign is coming back with an apology. There's a lesson here. It, it might have been very karmic. You know, um, the connection is codependent. Someone is still in that lower vibration. They haven't seeing exactly what Libra means to them what the connection could really be if they learn to um, to channel you know the connection better and the energy better um, they might even want to offer you something really solid you guys had this new start maybe with this person. You, you clear the air. You started to communicate. You clear the air with them. I feel like this is two separate levers. Uh, some of you dealing with Capricorn, Virgo, Taurus. You clear the air in regards to the offer. Someone might have, you know, proposed to you or took the relationship to another level. There was a clearing of something. Some truth had to be spoken here. Some of you don't know if you should go back into a connection. Yeah. That was heartbreaking. Or that may even be third party and you know about it. And maybe some of you are standing your ground against um, maybe the king of pentacles. Could be any sign. Maybe some, 
I'm somebody's husband, somebody's wife. They may be rushing back towards you with passion, you know, wanting to get back into the connection because of sex, sexual activity. You are their wish fulfillment. But it's based in emotion and carnal pleasure. It's not, they're not offering anything grounded. You're still here. You know what, what, what this can be, the three of swords. What it'll end up being for you. I think Libra is standing their ground against this person, listening to their intuition, even though there might be some indecision. Uh, you might have had communication in regards to what this, your worth and what this relationship could be or what it was. And you might have cut someone or something out, maybe a Taurus or Aries. Some very dominating person from your past who you were holding on to or they were holding on to you you may just decide to chart a new path go in a new direction here king of wands and queen of wands even though this is like you know the dynamic duo you guys are in a sense meant to be together but you're seeing things in a new perspective Clarity came through. Some of you got readings, got um, some kind of spiritual clarity about what's to come to you. Some of you, dreams, premonitions, uh, epiphanies. You cut someone out, cut something out. It, it caused you a lot of emotional upset and mental upset, even maybe for this other person. Because you know that you want to solidify the relationship. But you can't do that if you're a third party or they have a third party or it's just a party. Um, there's no winners here. You lost, they lost. Nobody got what they wanted. It may cause a tower moment for this person, this Cancer Pisces Scorpio, to the point where they then begin to be honest about future plans, maybe with you or in regards to what they want to do in their lives, how they've been through a lot, maybe with uh, another air sign, how they want to move on, get in control of their situation have positivity elsewhere and, and they're trying to manifest that all while being confused about an ending we're still up in their head about it juggling two very real options that could be two people that could be to be single or to be partnered if that didn't resonate, let's see. This deck has reversals. What's going on here? Thank you for the messages for the Libra Collective. Eight of Cups. All right, someone is abandoning, abandoning um, one path and going to another. Just walking away. You know, completely. I don't care. To be Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Knight of Swords. They're doing it pretty quickly. Three of Wands in reverse. Someone's no longer waiting for things to shift. For someone to come in and give a message. For someone to come in and sweep them off their feet and give them what they're looking for. They're taking action. Six of Swords moving away from. Eight of Cups and Six of Swords. Somebody's moving. There's an actual move. No one's. It's like 
somebody's like, I'm not waiting for it anything or anybody no one's coming to save me is what I'm hearing I want to save myself justice yeah Libra this is you you're it's like I'm not I can no longer wait for this two of pentacle yeah you're definite some of you are definitely moving moving like physically moving home page of pentacles in reverse you no longer want to establish something Either here in this location, here in the city, here in a relationship, a business partnership, you're moving away from. You've taken back the pentacle. Three of cups in reverse. You don't. <laughs> Ten of cups in reverse. To hell with it all. I don't want to reconcile. I don't want this family dynamic. I was or am not happy. I was faking my happiness or I was going along to get along and then the ace of pentacle in reverse pops out yeah I no longer want to invest here I don't even want whatever is being offered knight of wands in reverse not moving forward with something eight of pentacles putting work in on yourself strength card upright having the strength and the courage to to go in a new direction the hermit in reverse coming out of trying to find spiritual and mental emotional clarity by way of looking at past experience you've you've done the work seven of pentacles are no longer waiting ten of swords i'm disappointed i didn't get what i wanted i'm done the world in reverse though Either someone's not letting go of you or you're not letting go of a situation. Or maybe you didn't learn the lesson here. Six of Wands in reverse. You didn't get victory here. And I think that's why you shifted the course. The Lovers in reverse. You're no longer even waiting for a decision. Maybe from a Cancer. The Chariot Upright. Or you're just moving forward. Two of Cups. Seven of Cups. Four of Swords. It looks like once you decide to move away from someone comes back. Someone is is um, realizing what you mean to them, Libra. They're, they are emotionally confused about this connection, Four of Swords. There is um, separation. No messages coming in. But someone wanting to reignite this and offer love. Maybe Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. They were at a crossroads, but they laid that down now. Eight of Swords in reverse. They no longer feel stuck and stagnant in a situation. Five of Cups upright. Hesitating before making decisions. In which this is someone may be feeling like they're offering to the wrong person or they did offer to the wrong person. Now they see what Libra means to them. Maybe they were with someone who's concerned about monetary gain, wealth. They were not being honest. They were completely about um, partnering only for you know monetary reasons, beneficial it was, that were beneficial to them. I think Capricorn, Virgo, Taurus, whoever you're, you were dealing with, Libra, they now see the air of their ways let's get you some angel messages here and let's get some butterfly oracle deck memories right bottom of the deck for the angel answers perfect timing nice okay so we have no so if you have it, a question out there the answer is no ask for help from others helpful people there are people who want to help Libra uh, there are people who see that 
You know, you need help, assistance, in whatever it may be. Perfect timing. Nice. Windfall. Nice. Windfall of money, uh, good luck, good fortune. End of an era. We see that. Healing from the past. New exercise program. That's nice. This is really nice. End of an era. It looks like what, what keeps you stagnant or what keeps another person stuck to you are memories. Heal from what happened in the past. Either you're moving forward with this person or you're not. We have the world in reverse. I think there's some indecision about moving forward. But know that it's the end of an era for you. It could be financially too. Um, we did have some really good finance cards. Um, put in the work in on yourself. Put in the hard work in. Um, it looks really good for you, Libra. Someone comes back, stirs up some some old emotion. Uh, you just have to decide if you want to jump back into it. Know that there's this person loves you, but it's still not exactly what you want. It's still friction. It's still kinks to be ironed out. This person may still be in someone else's energy. This person may still be keeping options open or, or vice versa. Uh, some of you have someone who realize you're worth Libra and they want to come back and offer something to you. I don't know if you're taking to it. Uh, someone feels like you are a gold digger Libra um, and you have to kind of defend yourself against that it feels like it's it's outsiders all right so libra if this resonated with you please like share comment subscribe to the channel it's much appreciated make sure you're commenting below all of my information of how to get in contact with me is below go ahead and check me out thank you take care and remember to stay in prayer